In this question, we have parametric equations between, well, we want, to, we want to have parametric equations between two points. And the 6, 10 is the start, and the 8, negative 1 is the end. And we want it to have this form here. So let's think of, first of all, we have two points. Uh, these are not at all drawn to uh, where they actually would be. What we're going to compute is this vector v right here. And so we're starting to end. We know how to compute v. It's end minus start. And the equation for the line. I'll write it as L of t, it's going to be v times t plus start. And this is uh, just going to be v times t right there. Um, it won't, well, technically v is a function of t, but it's just going to be the vector v times t. So let's go ahead and compute these pieces. So v end minus start, so our end is 8, negative 1, minus start 6, 10, 8 minus 6, and it's turning into a vector, it's not a point anymore, 8 minus 6 is 2, negative 1 minus 10 is negative 11, and we can write the line of t, it's 2 comma negative 11, times t plus start, which is 6, 10. Okay, this may look a little weird, but just remember you're looking at a two-dimensional, uh, this on the right side you're getting two-dimensional here, so I'm going to underline the x-coordinates. So your x of t is 2, remember, times t, because, well, maybe it's better if I distribute, and then it'll be much more obvious. So distribute that t inside, you have 2 times t comma negative 11 times t plus 6, 10. Now, x is the first coordinate of each of these added together, so it's 2t plus 6. And y is the second coordinate right there. And this is still L of t. So just the y's by themselves are negative 11t plus 10. Uh, the way they wanted the equation written, uh, we'll look at the y of t first. So c plus dt. So C is the constant, which is the 10 for us. And then the D is the multiple uh, in front of the time, the T variable, time variable, which for us is negative 11. And then A and B serve the same purpose, but for the X equation. So for the X, the A is constant. So that's the number six. And then the B is the coefficient in front of T. And for us, that was two.